the Greyer's Celestial Influencers, narrated by Zoran the Dragon. Oh, dear traveller, you've come at just the right moment. Our journey through the Roshis and Nakshatras has only given us a glimpse into the cosmic web, but now we must dive deeper into the heart of Vedic astrology the Greyers, or the Celestial Influencers. These aren't just planets, as you may know them in astronomy. No, these are living energies, divine forces that shape and guide every aspect of life here on Earth. Let me take you on a voyage through the heavens, where we'll meet each of these powerful beings and uncover their roles in your existence. Surya, the power of the sun. Surya, the sun, is the king of the Greyers, a brilliant orb of light that rules the skies with strength, vitality, and confidence. In Vedic astrology, Surya is not just a celestial body. He is the embodiment of life force, the very energy that fuels your soul and illuminates your path. Imagine Surya as the soul of the universe, radiating warmth and power. He represents your inner self, your ego, and your sense of purpose. Just as the sun is the center of the solar system, Surya stands at the core of your being. He drives your ambition, your willpower, and your ability to shine in the world. If Surya is strong in your birth chart, you are likely someone who naturally exudes confidence and leadership. You thrive when placed in positions of authority or in roles where you can inspire others. But beware, for Surya can also represent ego and pride reminding you that even the sun must not blind itself with its own light. In your life, Surya governs health and vitality, leadership and authority, ambition and purpose, father figures and paternal influence. Chandra, the mind and emotions of the moon. Now let's glide into the soft, silvery light of Chandra, the moon. If Surya is the heart of the universe, Chandra is its mind, its emotional core, ever-changing and deeply reflective. In Vedic astrology, Chandra governs your emotions, your inner world, and the mind's subtle movements. Unlike the fiery power of Surya, Chandra is gentle and nurturing. She waxes and wanes, constantly shifting like the tides of the ocean. She represents your emotional nature, your instincts, and your capacity to nurture and be nurtured. If Chandra is strong in your chart, you are likely a deeply empathetic person, in touch with your emotions and able to understand the feelings of others. You may find comfort in family, home, and the feminine aspects of life. But Chandra's waxing and waning nature can also lead to mood swings and emotional instability when out of balance. Chandra's influence in your life includes emotional well-being, mind and subconscious, mother figures and maternal relationships, nurturing instincts and creativity, Rahu and Ketu, the mystical shadow planets. Now, brace yourself, dear traveler, as we step into the shadowy realms of Rahu and Ketu. Unlike the other Greyers, Rahu and Ketu are not physical planets, they are the lunar nodes, points where the moon's orbit crosses the ecliptic. But don't let their intangible nature fool you. These shadow planets wield immense power in Vedic astrology. Rahu, the head of the dragon. Rahu, often called the North Node, represents worldly desires, ambitions, and the unquenchable thirst for material success. He is the head of the dragon, always hungry for more, driving you toward change and growth sometimes through tumultuous means. Rahu's energy is intense and unpredictable. He thrives in chaos and seeks to challenge boundaries, pushing you out of your comfort zone. His influence can lead to incredible achievements, but also tempt you into the illusions of life, fame, power, and material wealth. If Rahu is strong in your chart, you may find yourself drawn to innovation, technology, and foreign lands. You might feel an insatiable desire to break free from traditions or limitations, seeking out new experiences at any cost. Ketu, the tail of the dragon. On the other hand, Ketu, the south node, represents spiritual liberation, detachment, and the quest for inner truth. As the tail of the dragon, Ketu is headless indicating that his focus is not on the material world, but on the spiritual realms beyond. Ketu teaches the lessons of letting go detaching from the illusions that Rahu craves. 
where Rahu pushes you outward, Ketu pulls you inward, helping you to understand the deeper, mystical truths of life. He can bring spiritual enlightenment, but also create a sense of isolation or dissatisfaction with the material world. If Ketu is strong in your chart, you may find yourself drawn to spiritual practices, mysticism, or healing arts. You may feel a deep connection to the past and have an innate ability to detach from worldly desires. Rahu and Ketu in your life. Rahu brings worldly ambitions, innovation, and disruption. Ketu brings spiritual detachment, enlightenment, and wisdom. Planetary roles and significance in life. The Greyers, as celestial influencers, play different roles in the grand story of your life. Some of them are benefic bringing positive influences and growth while others are malefic, testing your strength through challenges. But whether they bring blessings or trials, the Greyers are constantly at work, guiding your soul's journey. The Benefics, Jupiter Guru, the teacher of wisdom and knowledge. Jupiter brings expansion, optimism, and higher learning. Venus Shukra, the planet of love, beauty, and pleasure. Venus governs relationships, creativity, and material comforts. Mercury Bood, the planet of communication and intellect. Mercury rules over learning, logic, and adaptability. Moon Chandra, the nurturer of emotions and mind, bringing creativity and connection. The Malefics, Saturn Shani, the planet of discipline, structure, and karma. Saturn teaches hard lessons through patience, endurance, and responsibility. Mars Mangle, the warrior planet of action, drive, and aggression. Mars represents passion, courage, and the will to overcome obstacles. Sun Surya, though often viewed as a benefic, Surya can also be malefic when pride and ego overshadow humility. The Greyers are not distant forces, they are intimately involved in every aspect of your life. They shape your personality, your ambitions, and your spiritual evolution. By understanding these celestial influences, you can align with the cosmic dance and navigate your journey with greater awareness, 